Hello, my name is Adit Kumar and I am a robotics engineer at Qualcomm Technologies. We are here at Amazon AWS to demonstrate the capabilities of our Qualcomm Development RB5 kit, which is capable of up to seven camera concurrencies and have AI modules that can be added for 15 tops of processing as well as 5G cap connection capabilities. Here we are going to demonstrate how uh, a robotics use case uses our product where we have two AI models, one running on the cloud and one running on our device, which then integrates seamlessly to perform a complete robotics pipeline. We have a large language model that's running on Amazon AWS cloud and I can send it a user request. And based on the user request, the large language model identifies what is the most appropriate object to pick up and the AI model on the robot identifies the object in space and does path planning to go and pick up the object. If you are to give a prompt such as I am thirsty, the robot will move back and scan and see that the water bottle is the most appropriate item to pick up for this particular request. Next, the AI model on the device identifies where the bottle is and then the robot plans its way to the bottle, picks it up and gives it to the user or drops it back as required. So let's see this in action once again. I'm going to give another prompt, maybe get me a fruit. The only fruit uh, on display uh, that would be relevant would be the apple and therefore the object detection model identifies the apple and picks up the object in 3D space. It's important for us to have powerful edge compute for robotics because you might have sensitive information like images or other sensor data that you may not want to send to the cloud or you might have time sensitive and latency sensitive uh, uh, code such as robotics path planning that cannot be subject to network fluctuations. Thanks for watching our demo and for more information visit qualcomm.com.